about where the end of the depot would be so we can measure it. Okay, it's 1711, is that miles from St. Paul? Yep. Okay. Well, this is Haskell Creek, but there's another creek on the other side. It's because it split off. Well, the bridge that we see in the photographs. Okay. Off of the map, yeah, measured it from the bridge to here. <laughs> so, so, so uh, the uh, uh, Malcolm, why don't you get over here? I want to get a picture of you, all you guys, uh, just with this as the background. So, get us. So, the, the this runaway track was put in 1911. This is the new one, right? Okay, so where was the old one? It Century. came past here. We went past here before it cut off. Okay. Okay. You see, everything changed after the avalanche. Got it. Because it cut the bank back and all that for the snowshed. And sure. Had to build the, the runaway track clear to here. And, and, and so, what other what other buildings were existing? You had, you had yeah. the bailiffs, which is right. So the depot is right here. The bailiffs are just about directly this way, and then they had the bar that was of the other building right over here. So. Um, when this new uh, runaway track was put in, right. uh, was Baymouth still there? Or? Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it would be back up in that right. through that grove of trees. They had a they had a, a staircase. Uh, it's in here somewhere. You can still dig it out. But there was a, a uh, staircase made of a stone to get up over the top. Of Got the it. Runaway right. track. Yeah. So. The, the the fellow who saw the avalanche was was he in Bandits or was he in the, the bar building or do we somewhere back here right I, you're talking about uh, Charlie Andrews no 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 oh yeah I'm talking yeah he, he was probably out here somewhere I would think yeah because if you're in the Bayless it was you know, farther west from you you know not by much but still sure. You know, so the west end of Baylitz would have been, see where that, that one tree is right there? The small one. Yes. It's right in the center. That's about the west end of the Baylitz. It shot out that way. Got it. Because it was right in line with the switchback line. Sure. And then the depot was oriented this way now. It's with a little the, bit further down, right? Yeah, right. Like I said, there's the 1711 is pretty much to the east end of the platform. And then the depot went another 40 feet that way. So originally the depot was oriented so the operator's office was turned around and facing that way because it was the tracks, the main line went that way. Before oh, you mean before, there. before, yeah. you mean the 19 This would have been before the tunnel was open. Oh yeah, sure. So then, they, well, then when they moved it, they just they flipped, flipped it the around building. and put it right here. Got it. Seventeen eleven is that miles from St. Paul? Yep. Okay. Got it. Pardon? You already keep on going this like okay. Got it. Pardon? You want to keep on going this? Like, okay. Motor shed and, uh, and the cover. Right. So the... They're, they're, so the runaway track then is just on the other side of that. Right. Right there. Right, right. Can't hardly see it. So there was the runaway track, there was the motor One shed track. That came the, back like that. And then the main line, and yep. then the two, two other tracks. tracks. Yeah. yeah. 
Realize that I, I thought that if the avalanche occurred near the end of the storm, but according to this, yeah. it kept, kept going. Which is a really weird thing. It's a very weird anomaly. Yeah. It normally never happens in the snow. Yeah. So thunder snow is the. That's what they call it. Yeah. Did you like that? I did. I found plenty of photos there. I'm gonna. It'll be interesting when I get into this to figure oh, out yeah. just how to how light to, it. To, to, yeah. How to light it. But I thought that was. But hey, that's what you need. Right? Would would they? Uh, well, I guess the whole area was lit was up. was lit up. Yeah, it, it just wasn't one spot. You can take artistic. I'm to gonna too. have to. <laughs> yeah, because nobody's gonna be there to tell that's, you no. That's right. The lightning wasn't there. It was over well, here. There. No, no. Nope. I knew I was there. You don't. You know. <laughs> Just noon. Pretty good time. Mm -hmm. So I gotta show you something, Craig. But but look here, Kevin. I was thinking because they were around the bend. Yeah. Uh, I'm I'm thinking somewhere right in here. Right. Yeah. Water. It's exactly. And we'd see the motor shed and the motor house. The top of that, so you'd be able to get. I didn't know when I got again, I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to cheat a little bit on that one to get the, the foreshortening. But you don't have to do it much. No, but I don't have to do it much. And you can have probably back three cars of the mail train, and the back four cars and five cars of the. Let's see this. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Because you're going to be cutting it off. Right, right, exactly. Yeah, and that this is not important, really. No. But because we're around here, and it's this bridge, right? Or it, wait a minute. Yeah, it, it's this bridge. This bridge right there. The picture taken from back here. Yeah. So that bridge is the one we were looking at today, and that's this one right here. Yep. And this was the where the. Uh, the mile post was right by the yep. station. Yep. 